Welcome to the Windows and Computer Channel, and this is a little talk about security. I think it's um, nice from time to time to just remind everybody to stay safe on their devices. Uh, we were talking today about you know how hackers can uh, sometimes steal information, and changing the password is often the first thing you need to do. Two-factor authentication, also, of course, is nice because even if somebody else would have the password without the second uh, authentication, you can get in anyways. One of the uh, things also that I wanted to talk about, and, uh, you know, there's this prevailing idea all the time that uh, Windows is full of security holes and that it's, uh, you know, a security nightmare and that uh, Mac or Linux is better. And if that was the case, we would be, you know, enterprise would not be using Windows. Windows is as secure as any other operating system. And like every operating system, you would simply need to keep it up to date with its security updates. You know, we hear security updates for Windows because they have this, you know, Patch Tuesday update with security updates. And we have the impression that, uh, you know, only Windows does that. Uh, Linux and Mac OS also does that. Uh, Linux has a lot of security fixes every week, uh, which means that, you know, if they would not be fixed or updated, you would actually have security flaws that could be exploited. Uh, Mac OS, same thing. They have their monthly updates that has a bunch of security fixes. You might think that, oh, well, you know, 50, 60, 70 security flaws, this is incredibly, uh, you know, it's horrible and Microsoft should be ashamed. Well, there's as many security flaws in Linux and Mac OS, once again. A lot of people are in the impression that it's uh, actually easier to infect Windows. It is not easier, and it's uh, as easy to infect and take control of a Linux machine as it is of a Mac machine. People have the impression that, you know, that's not possible or it's uh, it's more difficult. Absolutely not. It has nothing to do with uh, being more difficult. It's exactly at the same level. Thinking that Linux or Mac OS is safer is a false impression that can lead you exactly to have viruses. And talking of one, um, today they're talking about a, uh, a new um, malware that... Uh, started uh it's it's newly discovered and um it's it's called uh it's actually a group that's sending that out and they, they kind of named it arid viper well it is shown that this is not only a windows um malware but it's a linux and mac os also malware and that is you know interesting because you see that Bad guys, hackers out there are targeting every operating system possible. Remember just to, you know, be careful. Always, um, you know, make sure that you uh, have your latest security updates. Do not, because the number one way people get malware, it's still email. Uh, do not open attachments from people you don't know. And even the people you know, make sure the attachment, if you have to open one, is a good and a true attachment, not something fake. Also, make sure you don't download anything illegal on the internet. You will be infected, uh, that's f for sure. Uh, software, movies. As a tech guy, everybody that did that had malware and I would fix their computers all the time. And don't rely on the antivirus for that because it's a false security. But stay safe on this holiday season. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.